I always knew that I wanted to get into my own business and set it up. It was just a matter of identifying what was the area to do that in. And having been with Intel as the quality manager as part of the startup team, it really showed me that there was a gap there in the market where if there was a problem, there weren't the support systems within a company or even external to a company to be able to correct a problem that was extensive. And by extensive, I mean there was volume to it biggest project ever, the repair of 250,000 purchase airports. That was another big tick in the box for us with regards to our name getting out there and providing the services to the customers. As time went on, uh, we had got more and more customers on board because they had seen our capabilities and um, we started to bulge at the seams. So I bought this um, two acres off the IDA. We built this 35,000 square foot facility uh, where we're standing now. ISO 9001 certified in 2001 and, and then further on um, we uh, became certified to ISO 13485 which is quality uh, certification for medical equipment and medical devices and then further on uh, we became certified to AS 9100 which is the certification for uh, aerospace and aeronautics. We bought a couple of um, uh, SMT lines which are the, kind of the, the backbone robotic systems in electronic manufacturing and those lines build printed circuit boards, assemble the chips onto the printed circuit boards, built our capabilities targeting those uh, verticals. The four verticals being aerospace and aeronautics, medical equipment, data center racked servers and uh, the last being automotive. We were bringing in you know, a new capability into the country which was separate but parallel to the manufacturing processes that were here already. That was something that uh, hadn't been in Ireland uh, previous to 1996. Once we were able to prove, you know, and that was very important, that we got that big tick switch on uh, in um, you know, November, December, January, uh, 96 to 97. And once we got that, then it was basically open doors to all of the other potential customers whom we approached and presented our capabilities to. We've used Realtime as a platform to start generating our own customers, to start building you know, entities that will become customers of Realtime. And I think that bodes very well for the future as we look at various areas such as electric vehicles, such as uh, autonomous uh, vehicles and, and batteries, home storage, uh, home, um, you know, uh, home generation of energy, uh, PV, uh, and all of those areas. Um, I think there are big opportunities there on which uh, real time will continue to grow.